Well, there's a new way to zip around downtown over the Rhine and the banks, and the price is right. Local Trails Brad Underwood joins us live tonight. He's an OTR with a look at this new transportation service that had a big opening weekend, Brad. It sure did. Good evening, Rob. Yeah, just yet another way to get around in the heart of the city here. You know, as we've seen the banks and over the Rhine evolve, so have all the options to get you there. Now, outside of walking, there's a free service to get you around downtown Cincinnati. You can ride in a streetcar. You can also sit in a bus or you can pedal a red bike. If you don't have a car, of course, there are taxis and other ride sharing options, but none quite like this. Just hail us down and we'll come pick you up and take you to your next destination. Come on in. Uh, you can take you to any of the restaurants, uh, any of the hotels, um, or if you'd like to go to the casino, we can take you up to the casino. You may have seen it this weekend. It's called Guest, a colorful golf cart blasting 80s music. We did over 300 rides just Saturday night alone. Um, the hardest concept for people to understand is that it's free. Yes, you heard him right. It's free, thanks to corporate sponsors. Patrick Dye and his wife are bringing the concept of free golf cart rides to Cincinnati after seeing it in Nashville. Right now, six carts cruise the grid from OTR to the banks and Music Hall over to the casino. The service is available Friday and Saturday nights from 9 p.m. to 2 a.m. The big push will be for opening day. Um, so we're just going to keep working on things. We're always going to have things we can fine tune. And but is it legal to drive a golf cart on the street? Simple answer is yes, as long as you drive it on roads with a speed limit under 35 miles per hour and the cart is in compliance. You have to have a DOT windshield, windshield wipers, headlights, tail lights, brake lights, low speed vehicle spot on the back. There's a big sign on the back, turn signals. It's a car. Now the die's goal is to bring about 15 or 20 of those carts uh, to the downtown Cincinnati area over the Rhine and the banks to use them during those big events, as you mentioned, opening day, the Flying Pig, uh, Oktoberfest, among others. As far as the weather goes, he said, you know, we're finally able to break them out this last weekend because it got a lot warmer. They're not going to run the cars if there's a hard rain or if there's freezing temperatures or snow on the ground uh, to make it uh, safer for everyone else who is on the road. Reporting live tonight downtown, Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. Rob? I think this is a great idea. I mean, does it feel real or does it feel like a joke when you're riding in that thing? I mean, it feels real. I mean, I think we all, many of us know what it feels like to ride in a golf cart. This is quite different. It's got all the lights and the music, and you're, you're driving around downtown in a golf cart. It seems a little odd, but hopefully <laughs> um, people like it. He said it was well-received this weekend. Yeah, it's fun. All right, Brad, thanks very much. If the service is well-received, you could see guests pop up in northern Kentucky and some other cities around the region.